I welcome you all in the next video tutorial. So the next drug we are having with us is Artemisia or commonly known as the Santonica and Worm Seed. So let's start our next plant that is Artemisia. So as you can see sweet wormwood, annual wormwood, these are the various names and the plant is consist of the unexpanded flower heads of Artemisia annua, Artemisia maritima and Artemisia brevifolia. So there are different species of Artemisia and it belongs to the family of Compositae or Asteraceae. Asteraceae is a subfamily of Compositae. So this is the flower part. Always remember one thing, unexpanded flower heads are used. So these are the unexpanded. Again, please see this image. These are the unexpanded flower heads. The plant is Artemisia annua, Artemisia maritima, Artemisia brevifolia. So about the origin, so this plant is originated from basically from China and grows mainly in the middle, eastern and the southern part of Europe and also in the northern, middle and eastern parts of Asia. Let's observe the macroscopic character of flower. The color of flowers are yes, yellowish in color while the other parts are whitish gray. Order, it is an aromatic and sweet order. Whereas taste is bitter and camphoraceous. It's just like a camphor. So again, the drug consists of yellowish or brownish flower heads, which are oval in shape. And always remember one thing, calyx is absent in flower. Just see a closer view of the flowers again. Just see, these are the flowers. Or you can say flower head, unexpanded. So about the chemical constants, Artemisia, particularly Artemisia annua contains volatile and non-volatile constituents. So the volatile components are mainly attribute to essential oil with the content of the latter being 0.2 to 0.25%. Okay, so it contains various type of volatile oil components and majorly contain artemisinin and centonin. So these are the sesquiterpene derivative present in this plant. So just see here, artemisinin molecules, it contain uh, endoperoxide 1, 2, 4 trioxane ring. Now you can see the structure of artemisinin. You see, what do you mean by endoperoxide is? So endoperoxide means any heterocyclic containing a peroxide that is OO residue in the ring. Now, see the structure of artemisinin. Yes, it contain a peroxide group. Now, let's see what is this trioxane ring. So, this is 1 to 4 trioxane ring. So, here it is. This is endoperoxide trioxane nucleus. This is very, very important chemical compound. That's why I am showing this. This is a structure of centonin. So, centonin is a sesquiterpene lactone. You see here, this is the lactone ring. And in sesquiterpene, this is the lactone ring present. So, it is a sesquiterpene lactone compound. Along with other compound, it also contains artemisinin 1, artemisinin 2, 3, 4, 5. These are the newly compound isolated from this plant. So about the uses of this plant, so this plant has a strong and helminthic effect, particularly against round worms. Okay, so this plant is frequently been it also used as an anti-inflammatory agent also because it has been reported in in vitro or in vivo model also that it has an anti-inflammatory activity. See here using Carrageenan induced rat paw edema model. So basically this carrageenan is nothing but it is a chemical that is used to induce the inflammation. So in this model, it is act as an anti-inflammatory. Okay, so it has a nutritional characteristics also, antioxidant, 
yes it has been reported that this plant has a immuno suppressive activity anti parasitic activity is there so artemisia is also used as a general health tonic in the form of dietary supplement just look at this research paper that is the anti helminthic activity particularly this is very much against the round worms so artemisia is very much used against the round worm infection also that's why this plant is also known as the worm seed just look at the use of santonin that is present in this plant the sesquiterpen lactone okay it is a drug which is widely used as a ant helminthic okay used to against parasitic worm helminths so different uses of wormwood essential oils are major use include effective against worms and parasite yes it supports the digestive system it elevates stress and depression so it is also used in a aroma therapy also so it keeps away fever and infection even you will surprised to see that this plant have been explored as a treatment against covid also just see this headline so scientists test artemisia plant against corona virus so this plant has been tested against this covid virus also but it still need clinical trials for the further investigation there is one important use of this artemisia plant because from artemisia annua two compounds artether or artemether have been isolated yes they have been reported to effective against malaria so just see the image alpha and beta artether injection for intramuscular use against malaria the formulation by the name of emal have been developed by cdri and cmap that is a csir institution in india and they develop this product which is a semi synthetic derivative of artemisinin okay so this is very much effective against malaria as a blood schizontocidal so okay so it is act on the schizontocidal stage of the malaria so here is this product artemether injection is available so that is all about this plant so keep learning see you in the next video yes in the end i acknowledge all the online platforms that i have used to prepare this video especially youtube slide share google images etc and other online platforms for preparation of this video this video is not intended for any of the commercialization purpose it is only intended for you for your students for the education purpose only thank you